I'm Myron Wigness and I'd like to show you the High Hog Portable Loading Chute. It's a little different concept than anybody else has. The body of our chute stays level, so it's never tipped too far ahead or too far back to hook your panels to. The floor is a two-piece floor. The back end is a beaver tail which hinges from this point and goes down to the top of these pads on the bottom of these back corner jacks. There's a spring inside the two corner posts so when it comes time to transport you just take some load off the spring pull your pins the spring actually helps you lift it up into transport position you lock it up and you're ready to go makes it for a really quick setup and transport the wheels and tires can be left on it while you're using it and you can load anything from a stock trailer a level walk onto a stock trailer or right up to the cattle liners from one spot Front jacks at each corner. The front part of this chute, or the front part of the floor, is adjustable. You can do it by hand. It's about an 80 pound lift. You can lift it and set it, but by the time you get some manure on there, it's a little bit more fun to use this jack. You lift it, twist the handle, locks to the next step. Go up one more step, twist the handle, lift it, twist the handle, lock it. Very simple, quick setup. Here's the receiver for the for the hitch. It's a two-inch ball hitch, and there's a jack stand similar to these on the tongue itself, and this becomes your jack for uh, for setting the front legs on your chute, for leveling your chute up. Now here, because we're not lifting very much weight, but we need quite a long stroke, when you adjust the floor, you you hook to the end of the jack arm. When you're using it to lift the whole unit, you unhook it here and you lift directly. You don't need, you need more power and not as much stroke there. So it, it will do both jobs. It weighs almost 1,400 pounds. It's about 12 and a half feet long. We have four feet of sheeted iron on the bottom of it. Keeps the legs and feet inside. Also makes, keeps them focused better when you're loading your truck. When they come up, they're not looking outside to the kids and the dogs and everything else. The only place they can see is straight ahead. We also have a stationary model which is the identical chute to this one except that you don't need to buy and pay for the jack, the hitch, the wheels, tires and spindles. We have an accessory that'll, that'll bolt onto your loading chute for transporting panels on the outside of your chute instead of inside it. You simply U-bolts attach these to the verticals on either side or both sides of your chute. If you have it on both sides of your chute you can haul 16 corral weight panels and 14 heavyweight panels and have nothing inside your chute so you don't have to put it in and take it out at every location. Now when you're loading your panels on the chute, if you, you don't want the, the tail wagging the dog, you want the weight ahead of your axle. So you, when you hook your panels up, you slide them to head. There's a couple ties here so you can tie your panels so that they can't slide back and get a negative hitch weight on your hitch which will start to throw your truck around. Mm -hmm.